Okay, everybody, here is the Burns Harbor from the American Steamship Company. They are zipping along now, downbound, on their way to their namesake, Burns Harbor, or at least I assume so. I didn't even bother to look because that's where they go 99.9% .9 of the time. They load iron ore in Superior, Wisconsin, and then come down this way and go all the way down to the bottom of Lake Michigan and Burns Harbor there. I just got the Edwin H. Gott before this from uh, up in a spot out of this shot. I always like looking through the trees here when they're first coming along. The sad part is we get all the cars and all the people which ruin everything, but what can I do? Everybody shows up at the last second here. I guess I'm guilty of it too sometimes. Clouds look pretty cool again. There's a watchman up forward there. You can see him with his bright yellow hoodie on. Sun looks great on her. If I pan back down and around this way, you can see there's the Saginaw. Almost here. So I guess I'll just keep the video going to get her as well. There's the sag. These two ships couldn't be more different if they tried. Saginaw is small enough to go into the MacArthur lock. She's a classic vessel pilot house forward design, so they steer from the forward end of the ship. The Burns Harbor is one of 13,000 footers, and they are more modern design with the superstructure back aft and the bridge is way at the top there. So they steer from the aft end of the vessel. No salute from the Burns today, which is a bummer, but that could be because the Saginaw is here. We'll see them come up bound here shortly. I'm not sure if the SAG is going to Thunder Bay or if they're actually stopping here on the Canadian side and going to Algoma Steel. It's going to be one or the other. I would assume anyway. Maybe Duluth? I'll look after. You can see her just peeking up over the deck there of the burns.
Very cool. There goes the burns. Safe sailing to everybody on board there. They'll be back up in a few days. All of the thousand footers are regular visitors here in Sault Ste. Marie. They load up above and then bring to ports down below. Sag has a nice whistle too. I wonder if they're going to salute. Maybe we'll get lucky. Wicked awesome salute. Big thank you to the captain of the SAG for that. I'm sure everybody enjoyed it who's here. I certainly did. Okay, it's windy again. So there they go. I'm gonna get ready to head back home. Time to get dinner and all the rest of it. I'll get a lot of stuff posted for you tonight, I hope. Talk to you soon, everyone. Take care and bye for now.